Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name is Marquita. And on this video, we're gonna be doing a flip through of the Bright's Mega Sticker Book. Super excited about it. You guys recently saw my pastel sticker book flip through. So I went ahead and picked this one up on sale, by the way. So I'm totally winning. So I decided to flip through this for you today. So if you're new to my channel, I hope you'll stick around and consider subscribing and also giving me a thumbs up on this video if you enjoy it. So let's jump right in and flip through this baby. If you wanna see that, make sure to stay tuned. All right, guys, so initially wasn't going to pick this up, but it was on sale and it caught my eye and I just wanted it. And because I told you guys, I'm not picking up all the things on this go around. I have a couple of things I want and I'm sticking to that. I have my list. I'm not going past that. Uh, this was um, something that was on my list, but I wasn't completely sold on it until I saw the pastels one. And then that made me, you know, get intrigued about this one. And I did a little mini flip through in the store and then I decided to pick it up. So super cute stuff in here guys so i'm gonna flip through everything page by page and that way you can see everything that is contained here so let's go ahead and get started first and foremost pastels anything floral i'm loving right now i didn't used to but i do now so i love the florals here and there's lots of pages and i love the color of the florals i think that is a big thing for me is that they have to be a specific type of color um, and so there is a clear page here same with these two clear page and then this one is the white sticker page clear page white sticker page so that's kind of cool how they decided to kind of switch it up a little bit clear page white sticker page so that's that's cool i like that and i like that there are six pages of florals y'all so, so a lot of this stuff really sold me that sold me these i love although they are in the journaling sticker book they're gold foil yeah and i love these and i feel like i always run out of these so that's why i got two journaling sticker books uh, because i love journaling sort of stickers black and white um, simple stickers i really like and then again gold foil and some of these are new like this watch here that's really cute you can use that to track like your apple watch rings closing your rings and i just think that's really cute there's a printer here there's computers here there's gaming stuff here so some of this stuff is new and then i love how they include a black page as well black and white page yeah so this one's really cute it is some stuff that's similar to the pastel sticker book but a lot of stuff is is different as well and i really really love the pastels mega sticker book you guys and i really feel like you can grab one of these sticker books and just plan with these and not have to buy all the things so this is going to last me for a long time so as you can see food right i love this for menu and recipe planning would be perfect for that and I love just all these journaling stickers. I wasn't that much of a big fan of the first mega sticker book, although I do have it. I wasn't that much of a big fan of it. I felt like it was too repetitive and there was a lot of stuff that we had seen throughout other sticker books and not as much new stuff and not as much functional stuff. I don't know, it's just something about it. I don't really reach for it too much. And it was a lot of animals in there, like a lot of dogs and cats and stuff, and I'm not into that. So I, didn't, I, I wasn't a big, super huge fan of it. So these are cute, really, really cute. And I love just the versatility of the animals. It was just all like dogs and cats and bones and I don't know y'all, it was weird. And so these are really, really cute. Oh, I love that. Now that's really cute. You can love that, do that for like a tracker or something. So that was cool. That was the animal section. Hopefully that was the extent of it. And then we get to some full boxes and circles. Don't give up what you want most for what you want now. I love that. That's cute. Oh, what fun, seize the day. Love my planner. Yeah, these are really cute. I love full boxes. Look how vibrant that is. Like, I hope that translates on camera because it's just so fun and bright. And I guess hence the name. <laughs> I always have issue with these stickers, you guys. I can't figure out where to place them. So I think what I'm gonna start doing is cutting them and then using the top for something else. I don't know. And then these are the opposite direction. So again, the layout of the sticker book is somewhat similar to the pastel sticker book, but the design of it is different. I love these, oh my goodness. The layered looking stickers are life. Yeah, this is a really cute and well thought out sticker book, I will say. Because this is a lot, this is a lot of money, y'all. So you want to look through a sticker book and say, hey, you know, I can use most of this. As opposed to I can just, you know, there's a couple of things in here that I want. Or maybe one side is good for me and the other side not so much. You want to look in the book and say, okay, pretty much I'm good with the whole thing. So, yeah. So I like that about this. I love these boxes. I love the little extra on the box, the dimension of the box. 
it's uh, those boxes are in the travel sticker book and I, I love them there and I think I used almost all of them and then these have a little interesting shape on some of them so that's cute so that's this side and so my only concern is without having a loop there that some of these pages might fall out like they did in the old one that I had the first one that I have but we'll see how it all goes so this is the next side So cute you guys know I love recipe keeping menu planning all that good stuff which by the way I'll be adding more to my channel you guys I just I film every day and I love it it's just that sometimes I have so many videos that I need to upload like right now I have probably like 10 videos which are all good quality good content videos that I need to upload and so you know I don't know sometimes it's just it's a lot but I love it so these are really cute weekly meal prep, grocery shopping. So yeah, I was just saying that I'm probably gonna be adding more of those type of videos to my channel. It's just that I don't want you guys to get burnt out and tired of seeing me. Um, you know, I think five days a week uploading is good. And so I just have to figure out like where to fit those videos in with all the other content that I feel like you guys wanna see more so. Cause those videos don't always get that many views on my channel. So I try to be strategic. I love these today to do appointment, busy. So that one's clear and then this one's not. So I love how they do both. I tend to lean more towards the non-clear stickers, but sometimes a good, good clear sticker works really well. This one is clear. This one is not clear. I love wording. You guys know that I love wording. So I'm wondering, I'm just gonna do a quick check of something guys, just cause I'm nosy. Just cause I'm nosy because this one has wording as well. I wonder, is it the same wording? I'm just curious. No. Okay, it's not. It's not. It's, I don't think it is. Okay, good. Good, I was just wondering if it was the same wording, just different colors, you know what I mean? Because that says, oh, happy day. So some of it might be, which is fine. I'm just wondering. Now I'm gonna look again. Oh no, this one says you got this. And then this one says happy plans. Okay, pardon me and my nosiness. Just try to compare the two, just in case if you're on the fence and you're trying to figure out which one you want, you know, cause it is again, a lot to spend. And maybe you're just toying between picking up one, so. Yeah, I think they're both really cute. I mean, it's like I couldn't choose just one because they're both cute. And like I said, again, even if you just buy these two, then that would be perfect because then you'd have two of these Becca sticker books to be able to plan out probably for the whole year. So even if you just say, I'll just get these two books and nothing else. So these are cute and the same ones are in the pastel sticker book. Y'all that ombre, ugh, the rainbow. It's so cute. And these are probably the same triangles. Yep, just like the pastels. And that is some calendar. So some of this layout, like I said, is the same. It's just different colors. And then trackers. Work schedule priorities. So darn cute. Yep, these, I didn't see that much in here that I have seen throughout the sticker books. So that's one thing I like about it. And I'm thinking this is probably gonna be the same wording as the other one. Yeah. It's just brights as opposed to pastels. And again, some are clear stickers and some aren't. And that's your bill pay stuff. And then a whole page of chores. And this is clear. And then this is not clear. These are really cute. Clean house with a little vacuum cleaner. 
So this is clear. I'm not sure why these pages are stuck together, y'all. And then this is not clear. And that's it, guys. I love this. I can't, I mean, I love the pastels more so because of pastel colors, but the design elements in both are just awesome. So I, I'm so glad I was able to pick this up and the fact that I got it for 20 bucks makes it even better. So there are 100 sheets, 3,888 pieces. The pastels have 2,956 pieces. So this one has more pieces, but they both have the same number of sheets. So. Not that I was supposed to be comparing the two on this video because this is all about brights, but I just thought I would share that with you as well. So thank you guys so much for watching. I appreciate you stopping by my channel. Hopefully you got a little bit of inspiration out of it and you found maybe something you want to pick up for your planner stash, which means you'll give me a thumbs up on this video and also consider subscribing to my channel. So thanks again guys so much for stopping by. I really appreciate it. Hopefully you'll come back by to catch another video, in which case I'll see you guys then.